beautiful love. Love, gay, LGBTQ, my TV, your on your line. This is Pride Palmer 2023. My name's Holly. And you're here fundraising for the RNLI. Yes, I'm here fundraising for the RNLI. I'm the deputy manager of the face-to-face -face team in West Cornwall. Yes, and how long have you been doing this then? Um, I was doing it on and off for about two or three years, and now I'm back sort of full-time um, fundraising. And I'm here with Becky today. And yeah, we're just here sort of promoting the RNLI. Um, getting people to become members and also um, spreading respect the water messages, teaching people what to do if they get themselves into trouble in the water, how to contact the RNLI if they need to. So is, is it getting busier in, uh, um, in Cornwall? In moment? Cornwall. Yes, yeah, so we're coming into our busy summer season now and our beaches get absolutely packed. Do you uh, find you're having more call-ups uh, than, than ever? Yes. Yeah, I think so, especially um, post-COVID. I think a lot of people are coming down to the coast, enjoying the outdoors, um, and some, you know, some of those people don't know what to do if they get into trouble, so we are experiencing a lot more call-outs, both for the lifeguards and the lifeboats. Which, so. which are the busiest areas down in the southwest? Uh, oh, gosh. So Perrinport Beach on the north coast gets incredibly busy, St. Ives. But to be honest, the whole of the southwest gets... You get a lot of riptides there, don't you? A lot of rip currents, yeah. The north coast of Cornwall is very, very dangerous, so we have to be very careful when we're in the water. Um, and also, interestingly, one of our busiest lifeboat stations, in fact, I think it is the busiest lifeboat station here in the RNI is Tower Bridge in London. Yeah. Um, they respond to so many call outs every day. So we're busy all over, but yeah, very particularly busy in the southwest. So, how can people contact you? Um, so, if you get into trouble, it's really important to call 999 and ask for the Coast Guard, um, and they will then put you through to the RNI and send out the relevant help that's needed. Right, have a great festival day. Thank you so much. Thanks, very much Thanks to the organisers of the incredible Pride in Cornwall. Title music on this video is by Jasmine from Plymouth with great thanks. 30 years of culture and the arts is a free service on Love Sometime TV. Don't forget to friendly share my videos, subscribe to my channel and support me through PayPal at ccsphoto1 at gmail.com. Thanks for watching the video.